Well, the first day of school is obviously so exciting for our students and nerve wracking as well. And those same feelings go along with first year teachers too. Yeah, I recently caught up with a first year teacher in Lexington, Richland District 5 as he prepares for this new adventure. There you go. All right, come on. We'll find something else to do. For Brian Jumper, it's a family affair putting his classroom together at Oak Point Elementary School in Irmo, something he never imagined when he was growing up. Originally, um, I wanted to work for the FBI, um, you know, but that, uh, that, that didn't happen in the way that, that, uh, that I wanted to. This is Mr. Jumper's first year as a special education teacher. After spending several years working with young people in after school programs, he decided to enroll in the PACE program to help educate students who have disabilities. I don't know what to expect, but I've, you know, from what I've heard, especially from the teachers that have been doing this for the longest time, and um, to see the energy that they have, and it's just to get in and, and get your feet wet. Jumper has spent a majority of his summer getting items for his classroom. Items he hopes will help students reach their full potential. So right here is more your our tangible items, our manipulatives, um, whether it's, you know, working with numbers, you know, again, a, a life skill. And as the first day of school approaches, Mr. Jumper says he's thankful for the veteran educators who continue to support and encourage him. With the support that I've had um, coming in here and, and so many teachers saying, you know, you're, you're going to do fine. You know, um, it's, it's going to be scary at first, but we're here to help you. Oh, uh, good luck, Mr. Jumper. And as I mentioned, he's doing the PACE program there, which is a program here in South Carolina that allows individuals to get a teaching position based on their bachelor's degree. Now, it is a three-year commitment, but allows you to get hands-on experience teaching in the classrooms as you work to get your teaching certificate. So it's never too late if you're out I there thinking that. of getting a teaching If you degree. think, you know, I always wanted to be a teacher, but I went mm -hmm. into marketing and I'm yeah. not liking it or whatever the case may be. Yeah. It's brilliant. All right, him. well, if you know a fantastic educator, we are just about to start up Teacher of the Week yeah. again. So don't forget, you can send us an email to tow at wltx.com.